Hello everyone, this is my review on the Mountain Dew Liberty Brew. So, uh, I'm pretty sure, like it says up here, this is a limited edition. Uh, probably summer or 4th of July-esque Mountain Dew. Uh, I don't know if it's only available in America. Um, I don't know, but let's crack into this baby. Uh, if you want to pull a prank on April Fool's Day, save a couple of these and then drink and then put them inside a window washer fluid containers. Then pull a prank on your teachers or your friends or whatever you want to do. Okay, so just spray it all over me. It is great. Okay, so Mountain Dew Liberty Brew going in. Yes, there's a nice familiar taste to it. It tastes like if you go to a uh, one of your local uh, gas stations or mini marts or convenience stores, uh, and they might have those Slurpee machines. Now, we all love the end of the Slurpee machine, or the end of the Slurpee, where it just tastes really good, right? That's basically what it feels like. Now, let's see what it tastes like when it's flat. Okay, it's flat. Let's test this out. Mm. Okay, so now what it tastes like. Now it tastes like gummy bears. Now, that might seem a little weird, but there's this company called Albanese, and who's not sponsoring this video today. But it tastes like, exactly, like they're gummy bears, surprisingly enough. But yet again, it always has that nice, nice cold feeling about Mountain Dew, you know? So, that's, that's pretty much it. Um, Lib Liberty Brew, Mountain Dew, go check it out, go to your local convenience store, or hardware store, or whatever store you have in your state, city, or your, your state, your city, your town, um, whatever local convenience store you have, so, pick up a Mountain Dew Liberty Brew, uh, Catch me next time when I'm going to be reviewing the, um, the well-played, uh, Pringles Cheddar Cheese. See you next time, and goodbye.